Hi, this is Lee Garrett and welcome to another weekly tip video. This week, I'm going to be looking at Trickster, a Mac OS utility by the team at ApparentSoft. Now, Trickster helps keep track of the files that you've been using on your Mac and gives you quick access to them when you need them. And this is designed to help you stop searching for items, which means Trickster can help increase your productivity. So I'm totally all over that. Now it's available as part of the setup subscription. However, you can also pick it up on its own. I'm here on their website. And if I click on buy now, the UK pricing is currently around eight pounds for this. On this machine, however, I'll use the setup version and I'll just do a quick search. Here it is. It's installed already and actually running. And uh, we can see that by the magician's hat that we have in the menu bar. So I'll just click on that and let's see what we have. In fact, let's just go back and close this setup window Get rid of some of this noise on the screen. Here we have the interface. Uh, we can pin it to the screen by clicking the anchor if we wish. In the main window, we can scroll through our applications, files, images, and what have you that we've accessed within the last week. We can change that length of time, and I'll show you how to do that a little later. Now, what we see here is governed by these filter buttons on the left. The top one is for all files, and if the images aren't clear enough, you can hover your cursor over the icon to see what the filter will do. Below this, we have flagged items, applications, documents, images, etc. Lots of default filters are available, and we can create our own ones as well. On the bottom row, and we'll look at the far left button in just a second, you can change the view type from expanded, which will show the folder path, to compact, which omits it. And you can also change the sort order. So it's currently set to recently accessed, but you can change it to alphabetical as well. To the right of this is a search box. So type in the application or file that you want to search for, and it should appear. I'll just close that. The settings cog offers some more options. You can access the preferences here, and we'll cover those shortly. You can pause monitoring, which will stop Trickster from monitoring folders for files. And you can empty the current list here as well if you wish to start from afresh. The final interface feature is the favorite sidebar, which can be toggled on or off by the star in the top right hand corner of the main window. Now, this is where you will collect your frequently used files or applications and adding them to this sidebar is easy. And it actually segues nicely into another element of Trickster, which is our context menu for the files. Hovering over an item will allow us to quickly flag the item or access its own settings cog, which is essentially an actions context menu. Clicking on that, shows us a menu which is generally familiar to us as there are lots of finder options here, such as quick look, copy path to clipboard, etc. You can also exclude the file, the extension of the files, in this case, app, or the folder that houses the file from being monitored by Trickster. Here, we're gonna add it to favorites, which I'll select. That's just a quick preview of one of this week's Apple-related tutorials from Screencasts Online. Screencasts Online is your premium source of Apple-related video tutorials. All of our members get access to brand new, up-to-date tutorials each week, as well as unlimited access to our entire video archive full of Mac and iOS-related tutorials. You can stream and download all of our videos on your Mac, iPad and iPhone, and even your Apple TV using the members-only Screencasts Online Apple TV app. Membership also includes a complimentary subscription to the Digital Screencasts Online monthly magazine, published each month and packed with videos, articles, reviews, as well as hints and tips covering all aspects of the Mac, iPad, iPhone, and all of the other fantastic Apple products. So, if you're ready to start getting the most out of your Apple devices, visit screencastsonline.com today and become a Screencasts Online member.